Welcome to Wavy Vaporizers. I'm your boy Early. Today we're going to be doing a review of the Flower Mate V5.0 S Pro in a nice metallic candy painted blue. Um, you know, this is my second Flower Mate that I ever deal with. First one was the V3 Air, it's the instruction manual card so you can send it in warranty card comes with the same thing as the other flower flower made did comes with the chamber for this the stainless steel chambers for one for the herb and you got the other one that has the organic cotton for wax or oils typical brush and pick tool got the five screens extra sliding door same thing as the other one now this one is not definitely not like the V3 though this one has full range temperature it actually has an isolated air path so that way none of none of the vapor goes through none of the electronics none of the wiring it's just straight up as you can see that's the bottom of the air pad is completely open. You can close it with the bottom sliding door. That's the heating chamber, ceramic heating chamber. This does go from 104 degrees Fahrenheit to 446 degrees Fahrenheit or 40 degrees Celsius to 230 Celsius. This is your normal tap five on the power button to turn it on, tap five to turn it off. This does have a six minute cutoff for you, so you will have six minutes of exclusive time of vaping you don't gotta worry about that shit shutting off in three minutes or four minutes you got six minutes now when it does shut off all you gotta do is rehold the power button and it'll reheat again this vape takes about four and a half hours or five hours to charge completely um it does heat up within 10 to 15 seconds the only thing that i have realized i haven't really been getting that much vapor i've seen I haven't seen a review of this yet on YouTube. I've only seen the mini version of this, which doesn't have a OLED screen like this one does. It just has physical buttons. This one has physical buttons too, but this one has an OLED screen that teaches, that shows you exactly what temp you're at. It tells you um, when it's climbing, how long, you know, it shows all that. The mini one doesn't have a screen at all. It's just you just wait for it to heat up and that's that this one you actually see it climbing you see the temperature climbing and everything now I've been using this for a couple days and I don't know why I haven't really been getting any type of vapor out of it so what I was planning on doing right now I was gonna put a screen on top of the butt the screens it came with can simply put that on top of it It does have a borosilic glass mouthpiece. This bottom part does get hot after it's in use, so you want to be careful taking it out. If anything, you want to wait a few for it to for it to cool down. Five taps on the power button. See, I usually have it at 446 because I can't get no clouds at normal temperatures like. You're usually supposed to be able to get clouds around 375, 360, 380, and for some reason, this puppy is not giving me clouds at that. Look, I'm going to have it at 390. See, it's at 390 already? That was about like 10 seconds, 8 seconds or so. I'm going to give it a few minutes. Maybe it does heat up fast, but inside, maybe it's not catching up to the, to the degrees the right way, even though it says the actual temp is 390. Now, like I said, any other vape, conduction vape at 390 is going to produce clouds. Let's see. I ain't get shit. I got a shitload of taste, but no clouds. I'm inhaling as slow as possible, slowly, but steady, and I'm not getting anything. 
and it's at 390, which is, like I said, it's very hard to believe that at 390, it's not going to produce anything. At 410, any vaporizer is going to produce. And I'm about to show you guys, it's not producing. And it's quality control pass, so I don't know what's wrong with it. I really don't know. Tiny, tiny ass cloud. At 410, I, I just opened the door at the bottom to get more airflow into it. Let's see if that does anything. I'm not getting anything, guys. All you guys that are used to these flower mates, if you guys have any tips to make this bitch hit harder, or have clouds, period, please let a nigga know, because like I said, I, I can't get this shit to hit. I, I, I literally got this bitch at 446, 446 degrees. That's like almost to combustion, and... This bitch is still not going to produce any clouds. Those are 10 second draws or more and I'm still not producing clouds. I don't know. Like I said, I've, I've seen a bunch of reviews on these flower mates, the old the old v.5 pro version this is the 5.0 s pro and like i said i've seen those videos i've seen people blow clouds this shit is not blowing clouds at all oh there you go okay that was one cloud out of the whole time 446 Yeah, I, I don't know what's wrong with this vaporizer. I ground up my herbs perfectly fine. My herbs are nice and dry. It's supposed to be hitting. 446, this bitch is supposed to be hitting. It's not hitting. I got the mouthpiece screwed in perfectly tight. There is, I don't know what's wrong with this. I really, really, really don't know what's wrong with this. Like I said, I don't know. So far, two flower made products, and they were not good. I've, I've tried other conduction vapes that blow this shit out the market, like that iMac Plus. I mean, that shit was producing clouds at 375. This shit's at 446. I can't get nothing. Baby cloud. Nah, this definitely doesn't have the wavy stamp of approval. I'm not going to even keep going for you guys. You guys seen it here. You seen the 446 degrees, long, slow inhales. I ain't get shit, guys. Um, yeah, I mean, I, I wouldn't waste my time on a flower mate anymore. Like I said, these are my first two flower mates. Not a good experience at all. That being said... Like I said, I've seen other videos of flower mates and I see people get clouds like nothing. I don't know what's my problem. Like I said, I, I grind, I perfectly ground with my Santa Cruz shredder. I mean, nice and perfectly dried bud. It's definitely not my bud. So, um, yeah. <laughs> if you enjoyed the video, give me a like. If you haven't subbed me yet, hit that sub button. If you have any questions, any comments, any reviews you guys want to see, drop me a line. I'll hit you up. Wavy, wavy.